Ooh, that should be a little bit better. Fingers crossed you can hear me now. <laughs> What's going on? Yeah, I was doing a um I was doing a what was that for? I had to do a, a recording, like a voiceover recording. So yeah, I wasn't plugged in, but you can hear me now. What's going on? What is going on? Listen, I'm seeing some familiar faces. Brianna, how are you doing? Snotra, Holofe, Frolicsome Grey, how are you? Friend Milk, bonjour. Sava, Kesibit, hey, how are you doing? Fair Bear, my wonderful mod, how are you? It's Tuesday today. It's Tuesday today. Bedoved, hello, what is going on? What's going on? I've had a long day as well. I'm not going to talk too much because we're going to have like a little catch up kind of chat tomorrow. But yeah, no, it's been, it's been a hectic one. It's been a hectic one. Brianna, I feel you. I feel you. We got Mimi in the building. And um, before I go any further, I'm going to be doing a streamily sign in. Now, some of you may remember I've done some streamily signings in the past. This is going to be not the last one I do, but it's it's going to be one that I don't do for a while. And this particular signing is a special one because, as you all can see, the wonderful Mimi is in the chat. And one of Mimi's pieces of art is in the streamily shop. And is fire i want to show you but like i don't know if i'll be able to show you actually let me just do this one second one second so let me just would that work actually let me just show you in the camera Jeez, you can see the ring light, but the ring light's messing the vibe up. Can you see that? It's with my pose that I came up with. As some of you know, I came up with that pose randomly one day in the volume. I was just like, and I can't remember who the director was, but the director was just like, yeah, roll with that, roll with that. Um, And it looks so, so sick, like. If you don't know Mimi Maru, her work's incredible. Go and check out her work on Instagram. She's always posting. Yeah, she's just like, I I could paint or draw for like a hundred years and I'd never ever be able to do that. So that's a special one. That's gonna be in the shop. That streamily sign in, <clears throat> excuse me, is gonna be on the 27th of June. 27th of June, that's the day before I go to TwitchCon Rotterdam, which is going to be pretty cool. I also know that TwitchCon are going to be live streaming um, like a panel we do. Um, like, there's who's going? It's me, I think Jen and Aliona. I know Devra's going. I think Tim's going as well, Tracy, Dave. There's six of us going, basically, from Baldur's Gate 3. So, yeah, that TwitchCon thing, we're doing a panel, like an hour and a half panel. That's going to be live streamed. I don't know if Twitch are live streaming it. I'll find out. I'll let you guys know. I think there's two panels, actually. I think there's two panels. I'm not too sure. But, yeah, that's a quick little update. Quick little update. Like I said, we're going to we're gonna chat properly tomorrow. Today... It's just about getting back to, you know, my beloved, our beloved game, Baldur's Gate 3. It's heating up a little bit now. It's heating up a little bit now. We are in the Underdark, which... Um, you don't want to play in the Underdark. You don't want to play in the Underdark. Mimi, take care. Lots of love to you, yeah? I'll see you in a bit. The Underdark, a lot of you have experienced the Underdark. I'm a, a relative newbie in the Underdark and ominous, 
ominous is the word I would use. Ominous is the word I would use. It's exciting. And also, the character, Bernard, you know that robot, Bernard? For those of you that don't know, I voiced that character like three years ago and I forgot that I voiced him. And then Aliona last week was like, yo, you voiced that character. Mitchells, big up for the subscribing. Big up for the subscribing, Mitchells. Glad to have you. And Mitchells, I don't know if you know, I voiced one character in the Underdark three years ago and I, I forgot. Aliona was like, um, yo, you know, you did this character and it turned out really well. And I was like, what? So, yeah, Amanea, I'm Bernard. Mad, isn't it? I don't even know what I said. I don't know how I moved. Like, I have completely no memory of this. Like, <laughs> I have no idea. So, yeah, it's a bit mad still. It's a bit mad. Mad's kind of okay. What's going on? I honestly think the mountain pass with the crash is easier than the underdark. Swear down. Hmm. Two options. I'm going to explore the underdark a bit and we'll see how we go. Cupid curse. I'm good. How are you doing on this, this fine Tuesday? Everyone also, everyone from the UK, yeah? I was at work today. Guess what one girl told me? She said... We have, I don't know if this is like media gossip or whatnot. She said, yeah, we've got rain for the next 50 days. Like, so I'm saying that like the whole of June, the whole of July, it's rain in the UK. Depressing stuff. Anyway, <laughs> let's get involved. Ooh. Yeah, Elisa, I'm hearing um, it's the same all over Europe, pretty much. Like, Madrid is getting, like, bad weather. Like you say, Switzerland's getting bad weather. But my mate's in, um, my mate's in Turkey, and he's like, my sandals are melting, it's so hot. Like, so... We need some of that. <laughs> we need some of that. 50 days. 50 days of rain. Melly, what? Germany. Germany as well. It's tough. Listen, if you're from outside Europe, spare us a thought. We're, we're having rain all summer. It's, it's not pretty. It's not pretty at all. Yes, the book recording, Seacrow, the book recording's finished, 1984. Listen, if none of you know that book or haven't read that book or haven't listened to that book, that's going to come out sometime in the next couple months. That book is so, so sick. Like, let's say no more. We'll, we'll speak more about that tomorrow. We'll speak more about that tomorrow. Right. June's Crater, take the heat. June's. June's Crater, take the heat. Junes, do you know, do you know I'm wearing a puffer jacket? Junes, I'm wearing a puffer jacket in, like, right, Junes, yeah? Hold up. Junes. Junes, this, this is what I'm wearing. This is what I'm wearing every day. It's so sticky. It's so, it's so sticky here in the UK. We are wearing puffer jackets in June. It's, it's, no, 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 June. You don't understand. You don't understand. It's, no, I need, I need humidity. I need, you see 95 spiced under, you see 95 dry, humid, your face is sticky. You're just, you're melting. I need that. <laughs> I need that. I need that. I need that. Ooh. Um, what's it called? Daisy D. Fluffington. You know, I'm coming to Georgia, Atlanta for, for Dragon Con in August. Catch me outside. Yeah, I'll be there. I'll be there melting. I'll be there melting. Big up the Raiders, also from Loud and Kerry. What is going on? One of my wonderful mods. 
Eldritch Kaninchen. What's going on? You finished the last episode this morning. We're glad to have you. You're up to date. Where were we? Okay, so... Gale's doing his... I mean, we we know by this point it's, um... It's a facade. It is a facade. I think I left last time saying we need to get this guy a Deliveroo, Uber Eats, something to put in his belly because the, the poor man just... Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. We've got our two twins here with their helmets. <laughs> Jeez. Twinning. Twinning. I love to see it. I love to see it. Carlax there. Looking cool with her hammer. This is the squad right now. This is the squad right now. Eldritch, I'm telling you, it's too cold. I need to re I need to try and say your name because I always struggle. Pan Ian Ananas. <laughs> I said it wrong. Sorry. Pan Pan Ian and Ass. Is it meant to be pain in an ass? I don't know how to pronounce it. But you said feed him now. And uh, the thing is, yeah, this this guy just eats too much. Like, okay, look, watch. Oh, I'll have to speak slowly. I'm finding it quite difficult to concentrate for my condition, gnawing at my insides like a teething displacer kitten. <laughs> Um, hmm, okay, so I think I have a magical artifact you'll be interested in, right? We'll click that. That is most gratifying to hear. May I? Okay, we'll see. Look at you with your hand out. Look at you with your hand out. Relax, Gail. God, you're just expecting. All right. You see this year, everything I can offer you, I'm wearing. I'm not going to give you something I'm wearing. Actually, hold up. I'm not wearing this. Yeah. Do you know what? Wait, hold up. One sec, one sec. That, that, um... World shattering the important you give me a suitable artifact. Please. Do you know what it angry? You know when you're angry and you're just, you're just snap yeah, that's that's Gail right now. He's snapping. Let's try and calma, tranquilo. Good. I'll take that. Critical success. Of course. I hate for you to think me impatient or ungrateful. No. Here? I would, I would never think you unpatient, Gail. Hangry. Very hangry. Oh, yeah, that's what I was going to do. You see this? Where has it gone? There was another robe. Where's it gone? I was holding it. Wait, hold up. Who... Oh, you're, you're wearing it. I'm not going to make you eat your own item. That's fair. I don't want him to eat his own item. That would be, uh, come on. Come on. He's famished. He's very famished. Give him a Snickers. I think he needs more than a Snickers. I, I think he needs like, I don't know. What's something that really fills you up? He needs like, like, he needs like Peshwari Nans and like Poppadoms. You know Poppadoms, you can just keep nyamming them and you're dipping them in that like mango chutney and that mint sauce. And then, yeah, he just needs to like indulge a little bit. Not worry about the calories. Yeah, we'll, um, we'll, we'll see if we can deliver him something at some point. No promises. <laughs> No promises. Oh, here we go. I think he'd chop me in two. 
All right, we're good. Gail, hold up. I know there's there's minor tools around here because I remember seeing them last time. But whereabouts they are right now? Could not tell you. <laughs> yeah, Gail's Gail's cutting right now. Gail is cutting right now. What's going on, Selena? How you doing? What's this? Someone's made up the unwelcome bit. Someone's. You see, when I hear my voice sometimes, I actually don't even remember saying anything. <laughs> I'm just like, did I say that line? We've got some ashes of dragon egg mushroom. That might be worth a look. Asm creeper. Yo! Yo! What? No, 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 no. What the hell? What the hell? What the hell? What? What is... What the hell just attacked me? Mad. Mad, 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 mad. You said R.I.P. Furbear, not R.I.P. yet. Not R.I.P. yet. We're hanging on. We are a little bit damaged. I'll give you that. We're a little bit damaged, but we're not quite out for the count. We're not going to go that way, though, because that way is spelling trouble. I'm going to... No! No, no, no. I remember. That was where Gail was naked in his boxes. I'm not trying to do that again. As... <laughs> that was when Gail was naked in his boxes. Naked in his boxes is a bit of a paradox. He was in his boxes nearly naked. Yeah, it was, um... It was an emotional time. Space. Space Ace, what's going on? How are you? Poor Gail. Exactly. Poor Gail. Listen, I've told the story before, but you remember when I was locked outside in my boxes. Trust me, I can sympathize. It's it's not um it's <laughs> it's not it's not a good situation to be in. You feel you feel exposed. Hold up, hold up. Yo, hang on. Bro? Take a short rest. Take a short rest. Calma. Right, come on. Let's go, team. <laughs> Gail removes boxes. Smaller pair of boxes underneath. <laughs> right. What is the? You see, with the underdark, yeah. Things just Even the mushrooms down there can... uh, let me try and all right, let's just calma tranquilo let's move overtly, yeah, it's a double o seven thing right now. you get me we're 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 assassins, touch stalks, touch stalks, do I touch them? What? What is this? Affected creatures can communicate telepathically with one another. I like that. I like that a lot. I'm heading down there. I am heading down the... Can you... No! Who is laughing? No, real talk, who's laughing? What are you doing? Are you good, bruv? You're hiding. 
Hang on, do I have anything to clear? I'm just seeing if I have anything to like clear the path. I don't think I do, but you know, it's always worth a check, isn't it? Um, can we get past this without getting too mashed up? Will Ravenguard, you've got to move faster than that. You've got to move faster than that. No! This is what I'm saying! <laughs> Wait, who's, whose laugh was that? That wasn't Gale. Gale, Mr. Tim Downey doesn't laugh like that. Let's have a look. Yeah, this is what I'm talking about. This is a bit more like it. Who are these dead people? This is worrying. Let's save quickly. Right. Dead... Dunajar. Dunagar. We are heading through the Underdark Mist into the decrepit village. Ugh. With all these mushrooms. The camp looks abandoned. Who killed all these, man? The Underdark is a very like i said ominous place and i'm i can't lie i'm getting some banging loot i'm getting some really really nice loot empty chimera it's my first playthrough you're watching it live and direct my eyes have never seen any of this nothing i don't know what's going on but this sword yeah this sword empty chimera no, ooh. deals an additional one to eight piercing damage to targets that still have all their hit points. Hmm. You, who could use that? You? P potentially, Mr. Will Raven God? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. This is defo... Hold up. Oh, no, no. Yeah, definitely. This sword's better. 100%. 100%. Give this to your brother with the helmet. Give this to your brother. Yeah. Spiced Undead. The loot here is... It's hitting. It's hitting. Kiznicki. The loot here... is popping off. Don't get me wrong. Yeah, that's it. That's all right. Because this sword... Nah. Yeah, yeah. This sword's much better. Oh, I'm not proficient with martial weapons or short swords. But still, it's still better than that one. So we'll take it. Gale needs healing. Do you know what's mad? We've taken bare damage and we've not <laughs> we've not fought any <laughs> we've not fought anyone. <laughs> like <laughs> we've just walked. These are pretty. The under The Underdark soundtrack just hits different. It's nice, isn't it? Can it what's the volume like of the game? Alright for you lot. Riley, how are you on an aeroplane? For those that don't know, Riley was on an aeroplane last stream. Oh, maybe the, maybe the stream before. And Riley's back on an aeroplane. Like, like, where are you going? Like, should I just start calling you the International Don? Just, just catching flights. Catching flights on Twitch. We love to see that, Riley. Like... Jeez, you you jet setter, you jet setter. Um, he's on an airplane. I don't know, actually. She, he, they. You're on an airplane, and you're not 
on airplane mode. Riley, don't, don't, don't make me tell the cabin crew what you're doing. Hmm? 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 <laughs> um, anywho, where was I? Is it quiet? The volume... Oh, wait. No, no, no. I can... The reason I'm... That might be better. The reason I turned it down was because... It was overpowering my voice last time. Now... Now we're back. You're on a returning flight. We're in sync, Riley. I'm Jean... I'm Jean Grey. You're Professor X. We're just... We've just got this mad... We've got elithids in our brains. We're just... Same wavelength. Anyway, hope you're having... Hope you're having a good flight. Safe journey. Safe journey for me in the Underdark as well. Fingers crossed. Um, what? What is this place, man? What is this place? This is proper booky, like, I don't... Right, let's, um... What's in here? What? Gang! Got someone sneaking up on us! Bruv! Just chill, like, hold your palms in peace. Too loud, sun scum. Heard you stumbling. Can hear you blinking. Noise gets you eaten down here. Reckon I'll hush you before something hungry comes along. His gnarled fist grips an axe. Um, no, we don't like this. Exactly, Brianna. Tadpole to tadpole communication. Um, what's going on? Should we? Ooh. I'd love bloodshed, but I don't really... This guy seems cool. I can be discreet. No need for bloodshed. My pacifist. I don't like... Yeah. Calma. Tranquilo. Fine. I'll let you live. But no, no, no. My hunt, and you're dead. No, 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 no. You don't... I'll, I'll let you live. I'll let you live. You won't let me. I'll let you live, Maji. Just, just so we're clear. That's that's what's happening. But spoil my hunt and you're dead. Mm, what are you doing here? Told you, hunting. Slave ran away. Took Sergeant Thring's boots. I would kill the slave and fetch back the leather. All the bosses in Moonrise will have Thring's hide. <laughs> Should I help you? Actually, no, you, yeah. I'm not helping you catch a slave. I should have attacked this guy. I don't... Would you really kill someone for a pair of boots? Sergeant told me to. Besides, we're talking about a slave. No, you've got to die. You've got to die. A bleeding heart. Eat it. Rob, pull your axe out. Yeah, let's let's get busy. Let's get busy. All right. You see you. Oh, you're kind of strong. <laughs> you're kind of strong. <gasps> you're level seven. You're level seven. You're level seven. This, um, right, do you know what's mad? Two of my characters are on half health. I did not anticipate this would happen. Oh, my days. This is very sticky. 
This is very, very sticky. Don't forget, I'm still level 4. He's level 7. He's over there for now, which is good. Let me see what I can do. Okay, so... All right, calma. Why do I keep saying calma like I'm Italian or Spanish? I believe that is also the word for calm in Spanish. Tranquillo. We need calm. I wanted to. Where's that? Hang on. I've got a little plan. Maybe. No, 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 no. Is it this one? Where is it? You'll see what I'm doing in a second. Yo, where is this? Hang on. That's it. The Scroll of Greece. Give that to my man. All right, cool. I'm just trying new stuff in it. <clears throat> Did that work? Fingers crossed that worked. Uh, bruv, you're gonna die. You're actually gonna die. I would go closer, but you just stay put. <laughs> what difficulty is this? I think it's balanced. Maybe you want to go to Spain. What is... Is calma not calm in Spanish? Oh, it's tranquil. No, no, no. Wait, what's, where's tranquilo then? That's the way tranquilo is. Rah, maybe I do need to go to Spain. <laughs> maybe I do need to go to Spain. Oi, Dread Snappy, guess where I'm coming in February? Carnival. But listen, I'm going to speak about that tomorrow. I'm going to speak about that tomorrow when we have a little chat. I'm coming for Carnival, though. Uh, let's punch someone. Where are these other ones? Where are you? So you're there. You're there. You... Where are you? I'm so baffled. You two are there. Where's the third one? Oh, you've got invisibility on. Great! That's really, really good. So I can't see you. All right, let's just end there. Oh my days. Oh my days. Oh, Tranquillo is calm too. Gale. Gale! Gale. Gale. I hope they got Big Max in heaven. Oh, they got big mats in heaven. And you can just, you know, that sweet and sour sauce, Burger King, Subway. I hope you are feasting right now. You deserve it. You deserve it. I'm, I'm really not on point right now. I'm really not on point right now. Daisy D. Luffington, thank you for the subscription. Big up yourself. This bloke, what is this? He's put me in some kind of... He's put me in some kind of force field. It looks like that force field, what's it called? Do you remember The Incredibles? Do you remember Violet in The Incredibles? She used to make them force fields. That's what this looks like. And... 
It's not good. It's not good. The silence bubble. Right. Oh my days, you took a beating and you know what's so dumb? I actually attacked myself. That is so dumb. Like, I deserve everything I'm going to get low key because I did attack myself by accident. Oh, Theodore. Theodore Solomon. Will Raven God perished, eating Big Macs, eating Big Macs in heaven with his brethren Gale. All right. What? Oh, you're invisible, you little. All right. I should never have beefed this guy. He's a slave catcher, but can't lie. I should not have beefed you because you're just on smoke. And I can't use, I'm silenced. I can't use Eldritch Blast. I can't, I'm immobile. Uh, it's just peak. It's just very, very peak right now. Did he, he just used like some kind of Kamehameha on me? You lot are like rem reanimated corpses. You should be on my side. You're probably like dead slaves. I'm trying to free your guys who are still alive and... It... It's not a good look. Jerry Chodj Chodjvi, I appreciate the goodwill. I see it. I see it there. I'm always biting off more than I can chew in this game. Critical miss. Yeah. Oh, no. Right, I knew that was going to happen. I knew that was going to happen. Do you know what, yeah? Do you know what? You know what that means. But do you know what? I have a habit. I have a habit in this game of biting off more than I can chew. I'm sh I'm sure some of you can relate. Like always taking on these these people who are just clearly on another level to me, and I'm like a little Jack Terrier. The fair bear. It's mad, isn't it? How far am I from level five? 714 XP away from level five. Bracelet block. You're so right. That is how we learn. That is definitely how we learn. Another thing I can talk about, well, like, I can relate to that. I remember I used to do jiu-jitsu. I used to do uh, martial arts when I was young. 
I got my black belt when I was 15 years old. And after I got my black belt, I got moved to the adult class, basically. So, obviously I was like 15, like, I don't know, five foot something. And I had to fight these big six foot four men. And I was 15. And you know what? A few months in the adult class and I was 15, I could throw them around. I could throw them around. So you're right, we do learn that way. We definitely learn that way. 4,500 hours, that is fire. Kitty, that is fire, I commend you. Yeah, I got my black belt when I was 15. I got my black belt when I was 15 years old. I was very confident very confident and martial arts is great for discipline like it's just great like it made me so much more relaxed so much more relaxed and yeah we'll, we'll speak about that another time my martial arts journey i started doing martial arts when i was eight years old my parents every how many times did i do martial arts maybe like Two, three times a week I used to train. Yeah, man. Jiu-Jitsu, Shoho Jiu-Jitsu. Shout out to my senseis, Richard, Colin, Michael. Big up. Taekwondo, she's a green belt at five. Trust me, martial arts is such good discipline. Such good discipline. It gives you confidence. Because... I knew no one could touch me. And that made me so much more relaxed. In school, I didn't want to fight nobody. I didn't, if anybody would try and, you know, mess with me, I'm just like, listen, bruv, like, you don't want this. It gives you a lot of confidence and discipline at a young age. You know, when you're 10 years old, when you enter the dojo, you bow. Before you go on the mat, you bow. At the end of the session, you bow. Before you fight your opponent, you bow. After you fight your opponent, you bow. You learn a lot about respect and how to carry yourself, a lot of decorum. So, yes. Once again, big up your daughter, like, doing Taekwondo. I love that. Anywho. <laughs> Where were we? Where were we? He's here, isn't he? I would re Cat. got someone sneaking up on us. Too loud, sun scum. Heard you stumbling. Can hear you blinking. Noise gets you eaten down here. Reckon I'll hush you before something hungry comes along. His gnarled fist grips an axe. Right, we're not fighting you. Just take it easy, please. Yeah, calma. Tranquil. Fine. I'll let you live. But spoil my hunt, and you're dead. Ooh. Offer him a Big Mac, he'll never see it coming. <laughs> Who knows? Mm. What's the terrain like ahead? Anything useful you can share? Yeah. You really are in the wrong place, son scum. Try this for useful. Falling down a deep, dark hole is the kindest death you'll find in the underdark. Why are you so horrible, man? Told you. Hunting. Slave ran away. Took Sergeant Thring's boots. Kill the slave and fetch back the leather. All the bosses in Moonrise will have Fring's hide. Do you know what you need? You need a massage. He needs a massage. And like, he needs like a proper deep tissue massage. He needs his feet massaged. He's holding a lot of stress. I can tell. He needs 
you know what he needs? He needs like his ears massaged, his hands massaged. He needs a spa day. He needs to chill in a jacuzzi, sip a pina colada. 300 baht massage from, from Thailand. Listen, I was in Thailand in January. You know about the baht there. No, he, he just needs like, I don't know. There's some kind of, you know, he needs to relax. Tranquil. Because, yeah. Why are you so uptight? Just put your shoulders up. Let them drop. <laughs> Alicia, without the keys. He needs a nap. You are so right. He needs a meal, a nap. He needs some love. He needs some love. There's no option to give him some love, unfortunately. <laughs> um, obviously, you're a slave catcher, so ban you. But I'm not fighting you again, so... I also don't want to... You, you see with him, like, the options are like... Help him get mashed up by him. Like, you don't really have a middle. Um... Maybe I could help. Help? You don't even know what you'd be up against. Slaves got ourselves some protection. Hiding up there in a myconid circle. Can't get past those rock flowers. They get in your head. Make you see things. Half my squad jumped off a cliff. Laughing. I'll wait here. She'll make a run for it eventually. Then I'll get her. Hmm. I'm not trying to beef this guy. I'm not trying to ask for money. Like... Yes, Firekin. I'm talking to to Durgar. Jerry Chov, are you are you trying to get me? Are you trying to get me? I'm trying to be calm. Namaste. Good. Do well, and there might be a reward for you back at camp. Do really well, and who knows? Ooh. Maybe the absolute will have space for you in her ranks. But that comes later. I don't want to join the absolute. Then you'll get what's coming to you. I don't want to join the absolute. What does this runaway look like? Deep known slave. They all look the same. But this one's got fancy boots. Who's Sergeant Thrin? He's with the rest of our expedition across the lake. Special mission for the absolute. Are we good? I'll just spud him. We're good. We're good. We're good. Alma. All right. So that wasn't so bad, you know. But I ain't really trying to stay near them. They kind of give me the creeps a little bit. Like, they're not very friendly. More dead Durgars. That's one thing I always forget to do. Just press Alt just to see what I can interact with. From now on, I'm going to start doing that more. Because I know there is stuff I've missed. Yeah. So. Yeah, like little things like this. Let me. Right, I just turned the volume up. Let me know if that's better. Right. What creatures live in waters this dark? Ooh. Don't worry, I know I'm on low health. I just didn't want to 
use all of these right now. But do you know what it is? You don't know what you're going to run into here. Do you know what I'm saying? Hmm. Go on then. Do you know what it is? It's because you just lose health from like the most annoying things in this place. Something will just drop on top of your head. You'll just be like, oh, great. Like, <clears throat> how, could I, how could I have avoided that? Unless I knew. Won't lie to you, though. This is incredible loot. What the hell is this? I'm going to save here. What? These look like shoes. These look like shoes, don't they? Maybe they're meant to. I don't know. Ooh. Damn. Ooh. You know what? Cliffhanger. Might take a little break there, you know. Might take a little break there. Damn. Yeah, you know what I'm going to do. <laughs> You know what I'm going to do, but we're going to take a break there. We're going to take a break there. Jeez, look at them. They look shook. You lot need to look more confident. Yeah? We're in the underdark. We're setting sail. You know what they say about big shoes, big feet? Wait, I got that entirely wrong. <laughs> yeah, we're, I'm going to set sail on the shoe ship. Soon. I'm going to take a little, little 10 minute break. We'll be back. Eat some food. Maybe a Big Mac. Eat, eat some food in the break. And think of Gail. That's your homework for the break. I'll see you in 10 minutes.
Yo. We're back. Listen. A decision has been made. You may think you know what option I'm going to choose. That's going to come as a surprise to some of you, but I need to do this. I need to do that because <clears throat> Scarlet, what's going on? Hope work was all right. The stream's going well. I had to make that decision, my friends, because do you know why? I do you know why? I need to find Bernard. I need to find Bernard. And I have some inkling as to where he is. <laughs> because Gail might try to eat the magical floating shoes. Listen, knowing his appetite, that, that could happen, Broken Yellowed. That could very much happen. But I need to find Bernard. That's like, I need to do that. This character that I voiced, Cypher, what's going on? How are you? This character that I voiced three years ago, um, I need to find, I need to find this character. Like, you know what I'm saying? Gale does not deserve to be on a cruise ship. He does not. He does not. <laughs> so basically. Cypher, you joined us at a great time because I am going to find Bernard. <laughs> Gail's catching a lot of strays right now. <laughs> Gail is catching strays. Um... Oh, we have to go past that guy. Oh, um, it must be around here, though. I need to find the arcane tower. You lot are cool. I need to find the arcane tower. I might need help finding this place, but if I do, I'll I will let you know. But let me give it a go. So No. No, 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 no. No, I know it's not this way. I know the rough area. Could it be up here? Mm. This is just good to do anyway, because I've not unlocked this bit of the map, so. No, 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 no. What's this? Dread Hollow. We are in Dread Hollow. What? What is? I feel like I need a David Attenborough voice right now. The Hook Horror! clambers about the rocky mountain looking for its next victim 
As it turns, it does not see the Boulder's Gate party just across the way as its vision is slightly impaired. But do not be fooled! Do not be fooled. It is a rather dangerous predator here in the Underdark. I need to be careful. I need to be very, very careful. Just calma. Just calm. Just calm. Where are you? Hello. Wait, there's only one, hopefully. I don't see another one. But things aren't always as they seem, as you all know very, very well. Here we go. Here we go. Hmm. Naked looking. Good looking. Hmm. Stop. Go on. Go on. Go on. That's a tree. You're not gonna. Oh, these are the Susa trees. These are the Susa trees. Let's get this hook horror. You're going down. This thing is getting absolutely murked. You did not stand a chance. Not enough resources. Oh! This, this might be the quickest fight I've ever had. Let me not talk too soon. Do, do, do. Slow whiz, you do not want the whole stream to be voiced like this. It would get rather tedious very quickly. Let me just... Right, where were we? How did you... You little... You cheeky little hook -hop. This is a bit of a dangerous position, like... I don't really like being here. Because we are like, no choice but to keep going. We could just fall off the edge. He's nearly dead. One HP. Go on, Gale. I'll let you do it with a melee attack. Sensational. Sensational. All right, these trees. Is this is this the sulfur tree? I know I need to pick the stuff off the, the not the sulfur tree, the Susa tree. Is this it? Moving in. No, the Susa tree is. Is it this one? I need to pick the the stuff. That's a sigil. This tree is really a good looking tree though. Oh, here we go. There's another one. DJ Khaled. There's another one. Where are you? Oh, you're there. Um. All right, you can be there. That's cool. Watch and learn. Go on, bro. Show me something. Not bad, War Raven God. Right, let me just calma on that. Mm. Way too far. 
way too far. Can I throw this at you from here? No. Oh, you're so annoying being up there, you know. Oh, there's another one. Hopefully you can just chill and not know we're here till I've dealt with your your good friend. Right. This this isn't going as smoothly as I wanted. We Ooh. No. No, 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 no. Fact, hang on. Get your butt up here. That's it. Not bad. Not bad at all. This is my time. Theodore, that was that was very good work by Theodore. Will Raven Guard hasn't been the most on form today, if we're re being really honest with ourselves. Dead. 2 HP. They usually attack all at once. Dread Snappy. And thank you, Panyananas. Um, Gods, it's hot in here. Can you just do a quick... That would be beautiful. No, I wanted you to just shoot your arrow from there. And you missed! Come on! Carlac's on 4 HP. Carlac is on 4 HP. No, 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 don't use that. Amazing. Carlac? Carlac? You need to. No! It's calm. It's calm, 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 it's calm. Hold up. Let's get going. No, we need to heal our friend before we do that. Good. Yeah, we should really go back to camp and rest. Carlac, man. Where are these Susa flowers? I know I need to get them from here. Do I go? Actually, I do need to go back to camp anyway. I don't just want to drink all my potions. Do you know what I mean? But the. Something in me, something in me says just fight the other one. Something in me is just like, go fight that other one. And, you know, once I have a thought in my head, I have to do it. There's no... Wait, I tried to... I tried to attack myself. You what? Theodore's about to damage Will with a critical hit. No. Brother. Brother, uh. Brother, uh. What? What? That was so dumb. Nah. Do you know why? Because Will, Will rocks the helmet better than you. But you can't react like that. You can't react like that. 
Hashtag who wore it better? Who did wear it better? Who wore it better? Alright, give us a 12. Ooh. Need some like. Dun -dun 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 -dun. Ding, 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 ding. Cheese. Ding, 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 ding. Ooh. Ooh, it's close. It's very close. Mmm. I'll let you all be the judge. Jizz. Where was I, though? I was trying to fight that one. Game with Becca. What are you saying? Are you good? Welcome. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Firdafs, the, the helmet isn't cursed. The helmet is actually quite... It's a bit of a lucky charm of ours, I'd say. I actually owe my success to the helmet. Gosh, I hate these things. They're so... Every step counts. Wait, hold up. Why is it just Will? No. <laughs> Why is it just you, bruv? <laughs> Am I in turn-based mode? Why is it just you? I don't know why it's just you, you know. Can the others get involved, or is this just... No! You're calling reinforcement! What is that? Oh, that can't be good. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Try and kill this one off first, before the others get here. Come on. Right, now we're involved. Now we're involved. <laughs> no, Firdafs, you don't understand the, the power of the helmet. <clears throat> you don't understand the power of the helmet. It's, um, it's special. It's special. Not bad, Theodore. Where are these reinforcements you called for, huh? Bring them. Bring them. I don't know if I'm tempting fate in a bad way by saying that, but... Come on, Gail. Let's try this. Not bad. What's going on, Dark Silver Song? How are you? You good, yeah? <laughs> <laughs> it's a noise cancelling helmet. It blocks the sound of Gail whining about magic items. Yeah, maybe it's got like built in earplugs or something. Harlak, you, I don't even know. You're just on one HP right now. We have to go back to camp after this. We have to. <laughs> oh my days, 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 oh my days. Shit, who are you? Philro the Forgotten. Yo, I didn't mean it, man. That David Attenborough voice was... It was, it was a joke, like... Um... Hope your soul is in good hands. Take you out. So you're just... 
Oh, come on, you've got a hit there. Two HP. Come on. Oh, you man missing at this time is... It's actually a bit... Big up, Broken Yellow Crayon, subscribed. Thank you. Thank you so, so much. Broken Yellow, I'm in a predicament. I... I'm lost for words. Brother. Are these your pets? Are they not house trained? Like... Come on. Where was... Three. Three HP. Hang on. I've got a shout. Big up me at this chaos. Just subscribed. What's going on? Hype train in the building. I know what I'm going to do. Can I put you to sleep? Immune to sleep. Arr, you annoying little man. You annoying little man. Can I knock him off? If I can hit this, it might knock him off. Oh, I attacked the wrong thing by accident. Will Raven Guard, 2 HP. Karlak, 1 HP. Gale, 4 HP. We're all hypnotized. Ladies and gentlemen, we lost Gale. We lost Gale. I had no choice but to heal there. Be hit, bruv, with this sword! No. No. Well, so much for peace. Can this can this one just die, man? Thank you. Right. Who's got them Who's got them potions? Bruv, stop hogging them. Karlak, you... Idle. Yeah, Karlak, you need to get up. No resources for Karlak. This is so sticky. Drink. Something very generic. Thank you for the gifted subs. Thank you, something very generic. Your name is actually, ironically, very ungeneric. I'm feeling it. What I'm not feeling is this current situation because all my friends are dead. Pushed me to the edge. Gale is dead, dead. Karlak is bleeding out. About to get revived. We need you, Karlak, to call something out the bag here because... Oh my gosh, we really, really need... Oh, we need something. We need something. Time to, push my luck again. Time to push your luck indeed. Not enough resources. This is my time. You can't do anything. I wonder if this is worth the cost. All right, I keep just... I wish I could send, like, some potions. There probably is a way to do that. Split them. That's it. Yeah, there we go. 
All right, cool. Where's that guy? Bruv, come down here and fight me properly. Oh, it's that madness thing. Can't even catch my breath. I have to deal damage. No, you can't even use that. Oh, Gail got put on a shirt. <laughs> I don't even know. I'm laughing so much because this is not a good situation. Do I end turn there? No. No, Karlak's dead. Theodore's dead. Will, it's on you, bruv. No. Not like this. Not like this. Not missing, man. Go out on your shield. I don't like this sword. Th this sword I gave you... It's... Uh, it's not worked out well. It's not worked out well. Poor Gale. Poor Gale. Poor Gale. Gale is so misunderstood. <laughs> Sad bomber clock. That is so random. That is. <laughs> yeah, they're dead, dead. Panny Ananas. They're dead, dead. The Attenborough jokes. Um, well, Eldritch Kanichen. This was um. This was sticky. This, you see this moment right here. This is when I should have gone to the camp and rested. And it's exactly what I'm gonna do. It's exactly what I'm gonna do. Because the annoyed. When when was Gail promised princess treatment? When when did we make this agreement? Please fill me in. Fill me in. Craig David, fill me in because I don't remember making this this agreement. I said I'd get him deliver room. I did say that. I did say that something with like a low delivery fee, not too far. The riders can't mess about with my order. I'll get him like a pizza or something from Uber Eats. Oh, swear, when I told, did I say princess treatment? Oh, Gail deserves princess treatment. Starion promised it. Is that right, Kerry? I'll have a word with him. But for now... For now... He goes nothing. Tranquil. Calma. Yeah? Sleep. Namaste. They really enjoy those sleeps. Those gasps post sleep. Poof. How long do they sleep for? It's got to be a good 12 hours to make a noise like that after you sleep. Right. What is this? A magic mirror. Oh, swear. 
You want me to change my appearance? No. How could you even ask me such a question? No. Can't slow down. No way. Not this face. Not this helmet. <laughs> Not this helmet. I don't know why I'm trying to make the helmet happen so much, but I think it works. Personally. Personally. I need to go on eBay and see if somebody's actually recreated this helmet. Because if so, best believe. Best believe I'm buying it. It's swaggy. I, you can see that at like London Fashion Week. Can you not? Can you not? Yeah. You, you throw on like, I don't know, Gucci, Louis V, Balenciaga, I don't know, Montclair. But what's missing? That leather helmet. I trust me, I see it. I see it. You, yeah, I see it. I see it. I see it. I see it. The helmet, the helmet, you throw on like a little shades with the helmet. Yeah. I'm a visionary. <laughs> oh, my days. So, we, we've long rested here enough. So happy I can teleport to the Underdark now. My contact lens is... One sec. Give me a sec. My contact lens is dislodged. You know, you know when the hey, big up my visually, big up my visually impaired people in the chat. Big up my contact lens wearers. Big up my glasses wearers. You know the pain. You know the pain. You know the pain of. You see, you see, you, you, everyone with twenty twenty vision, yeah. You don't know how lucky you are. You don't know how lucky you wake up in the morning and you can see. Not us visually impaired people. We wake up in the morning to looking like we're concussed. We're blind. We're blind without our glasses and our contact lenses. And my contact lens wearers, you know, because what I did just back then, I poked myself in the eye a little bit. I dislodged it. And you know when you... I know my contact lens wearers. I know you understand the pain I'm feeling. And you got to... And I can't wear glasses because they just... I wear my glasses around the house. So I wear my glasses around the house. But outside, I don't know what it is. I, f I just don't like glasses on my face when I'm outside. If I'm... S I was going to say if I'm safe. <laughs> if I'm just in my house or I need to go to the supermarket quickly, I'll, um, I'll wear my glasses. But if I need to be out and about, it's contacts. Call me Clark Kent. I've got two different... I've got two different appearances. You know what I mean? Big up Lois Lane. 
Oh, we got a few glasses wearers. Listen. The glasses community. Yeah? What? Okay, if you are visually impaired, yeah? What's your, um... What's your prescription? I'm minus 2.75. I think I'm minus 2.75 in both eyes. Ella? Ella talks to herself. First time chatter, consider yourself lucky. Yennefer? Me too. Okay. Some of you are a bit worse than me. Some of you are a bit better than me. Scarlet, minus 7.5. You were like my mum, Scarlet. My mum was like minus 7, minus 8. It's peak. Sincinda, you're minus 7. I think I might even be minus 3 now. My eyes just get worse because, like I said, my mum was minus 7. So, like, genetically, my eyesight just... Do you know what I'm saying? Something very generic, minus 11, minus 11.5. I feel you. I feel you. I need to get laser eye surgery, but something about it is just, I don't know. Do you know what I mean? Like firing a, a, a Cyclops laser into my eye. <laughs> really? Really? I don't know about that one. I don't know about that one. Where was I? The Underdark Beach. I was actually trying to find Bernard, but I don't even know if this is gonna happen this episode. Best believe I will find him though, before I leave this place, cause he is a priority. Brianna, your mum got eye surgery, yeah? It's worth it. It's very much worth it. My mum, she got a uh, laser eye surgery done, like, must be like 15 years ago. And imagine she, she's never used glass, well, she uses reading glasses, but she's in her 60s. If you use reading glasses in your 60s, that's normal, like, do you know what I mean? You're getting, you're getting older. But in terms of like every day, out and about, driving, working at a concert, she doesn't wear glasses. So maybe it's worth it. Wait, hang on. Where, where are my people? Whoa, 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 whoa. Chill, 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 chill. Is this... Oh, hang on. Let's turn the map around a little bit. What is this bit? Oh, no, that's just the corner. Okay, I've done this bit. Your mum had the surgery, but it reversed after 10 years. What, can you, can you re-up laser eye surgery? Like, can you get it again if it runs out? Or is that just being greedy? Is it like a one time, you've had your laser eye surgery now, you cannot get it again. I don't know how it works. Do you know what it is as well, yeah? Trusting another human to shine lasers in my eye. Obviously, they're professionals. I know they do it for a living. They do it all the time. But I just... Do you know what I mean? Something about it is just a bit... Intimidating. Just a little bit intimidating. I don't know why I'm picking these rotten mushrooms up.
Bernard's not in this bit. I know I need to go to the Arcane Tower. I will get there. But, like I said, maybe not today. Because I need to go back and deal with... I mean, you know who. What was that guy's name? Furlough. <laughs> Furlough? <laughs> Furlough is what was happening in lockdown. <laughs> He's called Furlough now. He's called Furlough now. Right. Asking your optician to cast Eldritch Blast in there. Really? Right. As we venture forth, keep our eyes peeled. That's that dead one. Just... I need to go to the, all the little corners. I'm in turn-based mode. I don't want to be in turn-based mode. What? This isn't good. This, this, this is not good. This is not good. What is this? Bullet. <laughs> Bullet. Can you, can you tell me a more intimidating name? Bullet. Yeah, what's your name, bruv? Bullet. <laughs> it's called Bullet. Oh my God. Gosh, you gross little thing. You gross big thing. Okay, here we go. High defense. Oh, you're going to be so hard to kill. I can already tell. Literally, I can tell. Yep, yeah, you're going to be like some annoying creature. No. Gail needs the shield more than anyone. I won't give in. Not bad. Not bad. Not bad. 26 damage. Done. 99 damage left. Can we do it? Fuck yes. Oh! Did you hear the time? Me and Karlak were in sync. Did you hear the question and response just then? I can't lie. That was amazing. The way she answered me. Oh! No, that was mad. That was actually so, so techy. gonna do what are you gonna do <laughs> oh my days 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 it this thing is so will's dead I repeat 
Will Raven Guard is dead. Oh, she's got one healing. Try me. Um. Oh, come on, Karlak. Why can't you? Why can't you? Oh, not enough movement. Heal yourself. Not bad. Can't throw it. All right, cool. Will man. Oh, okay. Cool, 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 cool. Unleash me. Ooh, unleash me. Oh, I just. That was so dumb. If you just saw what I did, that was so, so, so dumb. That was so dumb. Right, this, this turn, I need to get some serious damage in. That's it. This is where you need to hit, please. Good. Very good work. Oh my gosh, you're nearly dead. You're nearly dead. You're nearly... XP, you know. Are you joking? <laughs> no. I'm a little bit. Awake and alert. No way you ran away. You actually ran away, Bullet. Bruv, you do not deserve the name Bullet. You do not des. I'm calling you Spud Gun from now on. I'm calling you Paintball Gun. How can you run with a name like Bullet? It's not on. Brianna, you, you can't bet that dog. Why are you running? Exactly. Why are you running? Oh, great. All right, cool. Let's see what we can do here. If that bullet thing comes back now, that he's got his friends here. Survival is all that matters. Oh, we're going up. Okay. Not bad. Not bad at all. Oh, that thing came back! 
No, it can't. <laughs> no, no, this game. This game is actually so unfair sometimes. Now you come back. Now you come back. Oh my gosh, that is so annoying. So now I've got three to deal with. Don't use that. Oh my gosh. No, I need to kill you. Not enough movement. Critical hit. Not bad from Gale there. This. Bruv, if you run. No, there's two. Helping me! Oi! This one's helping! My guy! My guy! Alright. You're occupied. Oh my gosh, one of them's helping me. This is... This is brilliant news. This... Is brilliant news. Kill this guy, man. He's caused me nothing. <laughs> Why is she laughing? <laughs> Why does Karlak laugh at times like this? to him why is he like so why is he prone like oh not anymore don't teleport oh. Gale Days, Gail, you're so far. I need to heal. Oh my days, I just killed myself! No, that was so dumb. That was so dumb. <laughs> no, okay, if I, if I die, I actually fully deserve it because that was just the most dumb thing. I, can't, I cannot believe I just did that. The loss of concentration there. Oh, this little weasel needs to die. Thank you. Alright. That was so dumb. That was so dumb. You, Karlak, needs... <laughs> I'll explain what I tried to do in a second. But that was... That was a uh, kind of unforgivable from me. I'm not even going to front.
cannot believe I killed the Dormant. All right, this thing is going to come back soon. So whilst we're kind of good, get up. Get up. I can't believe I did <laughs> I was trying to heal myself. I tried... Gale doesn't even have a healing spell. I got confused. I thought... Uh, maybe it's happened to you before. Maybe you looked at a symbol and it looked like another symbol. That's exactly what happened. It was foolish, either way. All right, he's coming back. Basically, he's coming back. He's underground now, so we don't have much time. Uh, everything's at a disadvantage, so close. Not that. Harlack. Put some welly into this one, please. Oh, you missed! Survival is all that matters. Bruv, you need to. You just died. I don't know what you mean, survival is all that matters. You just died. <laughs> it didn't matter that much to you. Well, so much for peace. All right, yeah, you're hogging all the potions of healing. I'm, I think that's a good thing. You hold on to those, buddy. Um, all right, so. What are you gonna do next? All right. Fuck. Gale. You're dead again, bruv! You just said survival is all that matters! <laughs> You're making me drop... You're making me drop my mic. You just said survival is all that matters and you've died twice. Uh, let me just... Let me just drink my drink quickly. <laughs> Don't worry. Why are deaths? Do not worry. It is good. It's calm. Calma. Tranquil. Even. It's, it's, all, it's all good. As long as our friend with the fraudulent name bullet as long as he kind of just doesn't come out from the ground i don't want to tempt fate but as long as he is kind of out the picture we're all right and also we need to not miss that's pretty important too You obviously can't get down from there, so just... Alright. So close to death. You just need to kill this thing. Yes! Where's Bullet? Bullet, bruv! Come outside! <laughs> He's standing on business. Sleazy, he needs to stand on business. He wasn't. Let's, uh, let's revive... Oh, my gosh. Oh, no, you're, you... Oh, you actually died, died. <clears throat> Oh, hey, bullet. Bullet. Bullet.
Do I have a do I have a scroll of Revifa? I do. Sensational stuff. I need to use my scroll of Revify on this. What did you say? Survival is the what? Bruv, that's your own little mantra and you're not living by it. Get up. <laughs> Get up. All right, now we save here. I want to find, I want, I need to get bullet. Actually, hang on. You. Nice little nap. You, you, you heal. Bullet. Bullet. Bullet, where are you? Bullet, I just want to. I just want to have a friendly conversation. I just want to talk about the weather and how poor it is in the UK. Bullet, bullet, bullet. I think you're misunderstood. I think people judge you on your appearance and your name, but I know you're you're chill. Bullet, could you just? Come on, let's go over here. Yo, bullet. <laughs> Just a peek. Pick up this one. Because this one really actually helped the cause. I, is it gonna come back out? I don't think it is, you know. I'll do one more round. But I think Bullet is a little bit shook because I'm here, I'm ready to fight. All right, Bullet, whatever. Yeah, Brianna, Bullet, let me love you. Shout out to Mario. Shout out to Naughty's R&B. Whoops. Hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. Right, so. Spin my map. There we go. Hold up. 394 XP away from leveling up, by the way. We did good. You! This little... What have you got? Scribbled notes. The unedited reflections of a mad wizard. Scroll of sleep. That's very useful. Mirror image. I think I've got a few of those. Misty step. I see crystal. Interesting. And a simple robe. This is the Susa tree. Oh no, I'm close to the Susa tree. I'm not quite on the Susa tree. Is that how you pronounce it? Susa? I'm, I'm definitely saying that weirdly. <laughs> Uh, is there anything I want here? Nah. 
I like fish. That looks like a red herring. I'll take that. How do I get to that Susa tree? Do I need to... Do, what, do you call it the sister tree as well, Ella? <laughs> I think we're saying it wrong. I'm not going to lie. Susur. The Susur tree. Oh, so I was literally on the Susur tree. What's that's it? That's what I need. That's what I need. What in the all my energy's draining away? It must be these flowers. Maybe, maybe give it to Karlak. Yeah. Okay, yeah. Oh, what, you all lose your magic? That's a bit jarring. Oh. But that is what I need. I know I need... I know I need that to use. Yes, I had to do my research. I mean, I don't need it, but it's more useful if I have it. But if this, if this thing comes out right now, if bullet comes out right now, we're toast. We are toast. There's no doubt about it. We will die. This must be close to where I need to be, though. Because if the tree is here, then... Hmm. I'm going to hold on to it for now. Till I don't need to hold on to it. I'm, I'm just going to keep it in my possession. Oi, Bullet, I dare you to come out now. I, dare, I double dare you. Bullet, I dare you. Bullet, I dare you to come out now. What's wrong with them? Why are they... Right. No, that's that's exactly where we need to go. We need to go back down to the underdark. I know we're in the underdark, but you know what I mean. We need to go back to the beach. To the beach? Uh, hold up a second. Hold up uh, one second. Okay. Well, I just had to check that really quick. Because that was a bit confusing. The map being on two levels is a bit confusing here. 
true Oro. You see Gale, yeah? I won't give in to his... I won't give in to... Yeah. Gale, I've learned how to deal with you. You're, you're hungry, but you're not re... You're hangry. Let's be honest. You're hangry. Let's go back down to the beach. Right. We're back at the beach. We've got the susu flower. <laughs> the, we've got the susur flower. And... <laughs> it's been a funny one today. It's been a very fun, funny one today. We have had a good time. The Underdark is... <clears throat> the underdark is mad. The underdark is mad. Versace Grandma, we need a McDonald's drive through order for Gail. He needs everything. Delivery, Uber Eats, Pizza Hut, Domino's. Just, he needs to gorge. Super size everything times one million. I've had a lot of fun today. I can't lie. Bullet. Oi, Bullet. Wherever Bullet is. Oh, he's actually underground somewhere we will find you liam neeson taken one and when we do find you bullet say no more say no more <clears throat> that is the end of today's stream episode 19 thank you all for joining me we will be playing bg3 again next week have i saved i've saved i've saved we are raiding Vegas, Venus. Let's go. Sunpipe, thank you for joining us. Rowan, as always, thank you for joining us. Kenny Ananas, thank you for joining us. It's a your boy, Loki, thank you for joining us. I love you all. Take care. Have an amazing weekend. Stay blessed. Peace.